welcome back to my channel welcome back to a brand new video today we are heading to H&M we're gonna go shopping I'm gonna browse the stores see what is new in and the H&M that I'm going to is the Trafford Center one where they have the new homeware section I did do a vlog on the opening of the homeware store part but I didn't really look at any of the fashion so I'm gonna head in stores try on some bits that I like the look of Bring you guys with me and leave everything that I do feature within this video linked in the description box below for you to shop. So I hope you enjoy coming with me. I hope you enjoy this little shopping trip. If you haven't already, make sure you're set and comfy and relaxed with a nice drink and some snacks always. I mean, always got to include the snacks with a nice cozy drink. And yeah, sit back, relax, and I hope you guys enjoy. think that I'm being that selfish right now You said yourself you'd be breaking your vow I can understand you're tired of this town And I'm not saying that we have to settle down now Just remember this We could have been stardust Same world but without us Something made us Made us find each other out there Made us realize We're more than just stardust Ignore this fact If you must To do what your dreams are Telling you to do Made it into the changing rooms Can't speak too much in store Just because of the music Anyway, I'm going to share with you The bits I have picked up first That you can see what the prices are of everything sizes before I do the try on clips. So these are just a good old basic 5 dollars I've got both a um, beige and white. They do it in black as well. Then this is $24.99 in a medium and it's just like a really nice long smock style dress in this beautiful kind of sage green. And then I also picked up this. This one was only $12.99 and they had it in white and blue and then like a patterned blue as well bargain if that fits nicely that's in a medium I got that and then I got these two pairs of shorts here so this first one is $12.99 in a medium and it's kind of like a crepe style fabric and then this one just same price same size but just almost like a slightly stone coolier coolier cool kind of color um, and a little bit longer on the length which I think I'm gonna prefer then these were 10 pounds in the sale in a size 10 there was only one so hopefully they're gonna fit I have noticed there's a mark on there though so hopefully that's not why they're reduced and hopefully that will come out if it fits but anyway try it on first this was also in the sale 12 pounds um, and in a medium again I just thought this would be a lovely kind of lightweight knit for the warmer months it's got this nice slit up the side so I'm going to try it on with my jeans and I just feel like this kind of oatmeal colour is lovely then I've got this two piece set $12.99 for the top in a medium it's like a thick grey rib and then $12.99 in a medium for the bottoms very casual around the house chilling kind of vibes with that one and then a little pop of colour with this blue shirt I thought this would look lovely on like a summer's holiday either as like a beach cover up or just like tucked into jeans or shorts even got it in a medium because I do think it's already kind of an oversized fit so we'll try it on anyway $17.99 that one is right so without further ado let's get trying on and then you already know that once I've tried all these bits on I'm heading straight up to the homeware section also this is my little outfit of the day today I've just got a basic white tee on from Zara my jewellery is Anna Luisa and my blazer is from m &S. I also have my Chanel bag which is open because I just got my camera out of it. Um, and then I've got these kind of like stone coloured jeans on from Primark with my Vasia trainers. Very neutral beige kind of outfit today but it's one of my favourite favourite kind of colours to wear so um, yeah this is my outfit of the day okay this shirt isn't actually as oversized as I thought it would be um, the sleeves are quite tight so I would even size up further if you wanted it as like more of a beach cover -o. cover up like throw over type piece um, or like to layer up as a shirt like this I would probably size up 
Um, but yeah, it's, it's a nice enough colour. I have one similar though from Primark, so I'm going to leave this one this occasion. It's from like a, it's made from like a linen blend as well, so it does feel nice, but yeah, I don't need this one. Okay, I love this jumper. I love the fit of it. I love the look of it and everything. However, it's just verging on that little bit of like that kind of itchy feeling so I just feel like is it going to be a jumper that I'm going to gravitate towards for comfort probably not and that is probably how I'd wear it I like the length of it you know to be able to wear it with leggings and I love the dramatic slit on the sides but I do think that I would end up not wearing it because of the fact that it's kind of like a bit of a bit more of an itchy fabric these vests definitely are just good good standard basics I think I've got like a sage green white so I am going to get another white because I do wear that one quite a lot and then I do feel like this is quite a nice neutral color as well not with these these trousers probably would wear these with my darker jeans and maybe like a white linen shirt over the top okay yet again this white basic I love so I'm going to pick this one up but also these trousers this is my dilemma okay I already own these in a 12 and the 10 fit snug don't get me wrong snug but I am getting into more like working out running and you know my aim is to maybe lose a couple of pounds at least so the 10 will probably be perfect when I may be more at my goal weight which is the dilemma because because then my 10, my 12s that I already own might be a bit too big um, and then obviously these are in the sale so they're probably not going to be in stock by that point but I think I am going to leave them just because I feel like I should be buying for, I shouldn't really be buying for a future size when I'm not even there yet and you know H&M will bring out another style that I'm going to love I'm sure so for now but I do really recommend them if they are still available online I'll leave anything I can linked even if they are in the cell, I'll try and find them. These are really comfy because they've got a stretchy waistband at the back so they don't gape at all. Hence why the 12 actually works for me quite quite nicely. So, yeah. Ooh, I'm going to leave these ones. Okay, these are first pair of shorts that I'm trying on. Love them. However, the medium are a little bit big. I couldn't see a small in store and I also wouldn't want the smalls to be any shorter. I do think I'm going to see if there's a small available though because I think the fabric and everything of these or do I just get a medium? No, they are quite big aren't they? Yeah, these are too big. I guess you could wear them a bit lower but I'm just a... I'm always going to wear things high-waisted so um, there's room for a food baby but <laughs> no, I'm going to leave these. I am going to ask them though if they've got a small available. I know I didn't see one but you never know they might have one in the back or something okay this medium however do fit better around the waist i think because obviously it's drawstring you can cinch it in but these are too short for me and my liking i prefer the other ones um for the length of them so i am going to ask if the others are available in a small and leave these in hindsight with this dress i do feel like i think the blue or white one would have been better for me because i feel like this is that kind of nude that like is verging on washing you out so um hmm yeah I feel like I know I am pale at the minute and summer is coming I'm probably going to catch a bit more sun but I don't want to be buying something if I'm not sure if it suits my skin tone now either so yeah I'm going to leave this one but 12 9 times an absolute bargain for this one Okay, this is the green dress. It's hard to tell what it's going to look like because the little loopholes where the belt goes confirm that this is a belt and I remember looking at the others and remember seeing the belt. However, this one hasn't got a belt. So if you imagine it kind of cinched in here, <laughs> let me just get, get, grab the rest of it kind of cinched in like that I do think it's lovely it's very lightweight which is nice regardless even without the belt it's nice and floating comfortable in fact it's just reminded me of a dress that I got from Zara last year in this color that was quite a lot more expensive so I definitely have one too similar and that I need to get more wear out of so yeah I'll leave it on this occasion um, last thing to try on is this little cupboard okay last but not least these are actually quite short um they do yeah they do come up a little bit short and also the medium is a bit too can you see it's a bit too big around the waist but i obviously wouldn't want to get smaller because of the length um i do really like it as a cord though it's definitely a lounge cord it's quite thin so i wouldn't wear 
I'd wear the top out maybe, like with jeans or shorts, but I definitely wouldn't wear these bottoms without this top and out. It would just be a casual around the house. But yeah, the fact that they're ankle swinging is kind of bugging me, I'm not gonna lie. So I am back home now. I have two bags of goodies that I wanted to share with you that I did actually pick up. To be fair, at H&M Home I only picked up one thing and then the H&M clothing bits you have obviously seen. I'll just run through these again but I decided to go for the basic ribbed vest top in white at $5.99. These are just such a good staple. Really, really love these. So that is gonna be added to my H&M ribbed knit vest um, collection. And then, yes, luckily they had the shorts. They were the last pair in a small, and I know they're priced up at 12 99 but when we were doing a stock check to see if they had a small, they had a look online, they could see that they were reduced down to 10 pounds. So they honored the sale price online and gave them to me for 10 pounds, which was amazing. I did also actually have a H&M members discount. If you log in and check online, sometimes quite often they have discount codes. So I had, I think it was 25% off one item of which I ended up picking up something that I didn't show you in the changing rooms, which um, was the most expensive thing. It was this, it was a shirt. Oh, it's not got a label on it, but it was 24 99 from the menswear section. And then obviously because I got the 25% discount, I think I think it was 25% off one item. I, yeah, there we go. Member 25% took £6.25 off the price, making it £18.74. And it is a linen shirt from, like I say, from the menswear section. They had these in slim fit and then they had regular fit. So I went for the regular fit ones, but the slim fits are £19.99. So you could, I suppose, go slim fit and size up. But my intention in wearing this is loose oversized thrown over has an additional layer probably worn with um one of these vest tops underneath this worn open and some black jeans or something black leggings i love that kind of relaxed fit and the rustic kind of color of this linen i just think it's beautiful so yeah 18 pounds it's also a linen shirt that um with linen i feel like you can get away with things being creased so anyway I really really like that so I also um finally last item picked up the robe vest in this camel color so I don't think I've got the camel one I've got already let's have a look these are the colors that I already have so I've got the white and then I've got like a more of a beige stone color and this kind of sage greeny gray so they're the colors that I've already got as you can see the camel that I've picked up is a lot darker than that one well it's not a lot darker you can see close up it is a slightly different shade it's a much warmer shade than that beige kind of colored one so yeah they've they've got loads of colors of these online and 5.99 honestly guys such a bargain such good quality I can I like wear that braless or I've got one bra that I wear from lounge underwear that's kind of like it's best suited to like halter style tops so sometimes I wear that with it anyway last item that I got from H&M home is um it's kind of like a a pot vase type thing well not a vase actually it's more like I said of a pot so they describe it as a flower pot and it's got this really rustic kind of textured finish to it I just think it is gorgeous it's a really warm toned grey beige stone kind of color that I think would look lovely in our house. This was 17.99 and I did have another offer because 
I bought the other bits downstairs and then I went upstairs to the homeware so I bought this separately and I had another voucher online for three pounds off so I used that so three pounds off 17.99 I got this one for and it is like I said designed to be like a flower pot and um, which they did have some kind of ferns I think in store they had a fern which looks lovely but I also think this would just look lovely like in the middle of a kitchen island or on a worktop or something or on a console table as you're walking into the house to be used more as like a kind of a bit of a dumping bowl for like keys, change, um, receipts, that kind of a thing. So yeah, that's what I'm probably gonna use this for, but for now, I could maybe style it up somewhere upstairs until we've done the downstairs renovations, but I just, it was the texture that sold me to this and the color and the irregularity on the rim, I just think, I think it's beautiful and I do think $17.99 is a good price point for that because sometimes some of their vases and things are sort of priced from £25 ish so yeah for £17.99 bargain so anyway that is everything that I did pick up from H&M hope you guys have enjoyed coming with me on this little shopping trip let me know which were some of your favorites that I either tried on any spies that you found whilst I was in the homeware section that you liked the look of and definitely let me know if you want me to do more of these kind of come shop with me style videos in store doing try on clips like this because um yeah your feedback is so important and it essentially determines what sort of content I film for you guys so thanks for watching thumbs up if you did enjoy it subscribe for more and I hope to see you all very very soon in my next video bye guys